Hello Aquarius, it's Milady from Milady's Way Care and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of September 24th through October 1st, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oceanic Tarot Cards by Jane Wild, uh, uh, Lucy Cavendish. Um, I wanted to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below, email me and we can set something up. Other than that, check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And let's get the show on the road, okay? Alright, what's going on with the Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius? What's going on with the Aquarius for the week of 9, 24 through 10, 1, 2017? Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Aquarius love reading, what's going on? All right, so it seems like somebody has some uh, issues with some um, their partner. Maybe your partner has some issues against you or you them, but somebody is um, thinking untruths. Maybe somebody is um, blaming someone for cheating or just doing like little malicious stuff, but they really aren't. All right, so it's something about trying to move in. So either somebody is trying to move, uh, go on a trip, or somebody is trying to move in with you, and you think it's just like, uh, to, or trying to move out with, of you. I mean, all, <laughs> sorry, or they're trying to move out of your place, and you think they're trying to um, just do it so they can cheat, or because they don't want to be with you, and it's not like that. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. For some of you, you think that they um they are leaving you to be somebody with somebody they work with, or um you th you think this about them, or they think this about you. Okay. Mm. Okay. So I'm feeling like you think this is a wise decision, and I'm getting a feeling because something like this happened before. So you assuming and that's what's going on now. Ooh. Okay. Um, it's not the cheat. Uh, it's basically just because they don't love you anymore. Or this could be the other way around. It's a general reading. Mm. Wow. Okay, so it seems like they they have been feeling this for a long time. Or you've been feeling it. They don't love you for a long time. Or it, they've been feeling like it's a wise decision to, to leave you for a while. I'm, I'm hearing like for some of you, it is for somebody at work. But it's just not what most of you think it is. You think it might be because they don't love you and it's for somebody at work. And then you think it might be for somebody at work and it's just because they don't love you. Or you don't love them. All right, yeah. It's like you refusing to see the situation for what it is, for the real reason they were leaving. Yeah, it's, this is um, it's time to go on your way, be on your journey. So this could be you leaving somebody, and they thinking it's one thing and it's another, you know. But it's like uh, you or they have been getting signs that um, you either or, you know, whichever one of these two. Um, but they were feeling to look, look at it. Be, I mean, they just wasn't, wasn't ready. Okay. All right. My Cleo cards, I read these straight out the books and sure you get your full message. All right. What's going on with the Aquarius? What's going on with the Aquarius love reading for the week of October, September 24th through October 1st, 2017. Aquarius love reading September 24th through October 1st, 2017. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Cut it out. Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. Mm. So it seems like uh, you've been asking this person for money or this person. Cut it out. 
this person's been asking you for money, but I feel like it's being turned down. It's like I already got what I need. I don't need nothing else from you. Let's see what these two are talking about. Yeah, somebody wants a divorce. Somebody is um sick of being in this uh, situation. I feel like in the past there was love there, but now, now you guys feel like you're always, well, somebody, you or them, feel like they're all on the defense of all the time. And they just ready to go. They're ready to uh, sign the papers. Alright, so it seems like whatever the situation will be good for you guys. No more fighting. Okay. And, oh. Okay, so it seems like maybe both of them are true. Or maybe this person is leaving you. With for somebody that they work with because they don't love you But it's like you still failing to see it for what it is. Maybe the overall thing is you're not Seeing them what you know, you probably think it's money, but whatever you feeling it is is not you know, it's, it's The overall item is they just don't love you anymore. I'm sorry, but let's read the book All right, the nine of coins is reversed and it says Progress blocked, uneasy movement, and boredom. You know, I mean, this could be one of the reasons that the person is leaving or you're leaving. You know, it's just like we, it's, nothing's getting any better. So I'm ready. It's time to go. All right. Then we have the Wheel of Fortune upright. It says new events bring positive change. Your life continues. Look for opportunity and expect success. Possible um, the conclusion of a recent event for the better. Okay. Um, start fresh and look for abundance. So it's basically what, when you get rid of this situation or when this happens to you, everything is going to look good. You know, just keep moving forward, you know? All right. So we have the five of staffs reverse. Five of Staffs Reverses says, complicated disputes, verbal and legal deception and inaccuracies. So it's a bunch of lying going on. And I mean, that's probably why you don't know what to believe. You don't know if it's um, love. You don't know if it's somebody at work, you know, but it's like you refuse refusing to believe all of it. You're refusing to believe it's over. Okay. Or they are. All right. So you got the three of coins reverse. It says, this card indicates silly workplace rivalry and bored them with your position. So yeah, somebody's bored with this situation. They're ready to move on and start something new. You know, they just, um, this could even be a work situation, you know. You just don't love it anymore. You want to go find something else, you know. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs if you want a personal reading. Um, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.